Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Bearded man attacks teenager and what a burger for wearing MAGA hat. Realizes big mistake too late. When your kids go out at night with their friends to get a bite to eat, you always want them to be safe. Crimes can often happen unexpectedly and that's exactly what happened to this group of teenagers as they were enjoying a late night snack in a Whataburger when they were approached by a bearded man who randomly attacked them. The incident was caught on film and what transpired in the video is sure to fire up the adrenaline of anyone who is children, or anyone who stands up for the safety of kids. Kids of all ages should always be fought for, regardless of how silly they might be or the actions they might do. In this particular incident, it appears as though the teens are just minding their own business. You can see the look of what just happened on one teen's face. They seem like a group of kids who would be into skateboarding or video games, not exactly the type of kids who are out starting trouble unless it's meaningless teenage things, we've all been there, of course. That's when the bearded buffoon shows up and snatches the hat off one of the teens. The man then steals and throws a drink on a teen and yells at them. He walks towards the exit with the teenager's hat, stealing it as he looks back and brags about it. This is a grown man starting trouble and being violent towards a group of children. This is absolutely ridiculous, irresponsible, and worthy of at least a few weeks in jail. The man went after the kids because one of them was wearing a MAGA hat. That's President Trump's slogan Make America Great Again and there shouldn't be anything wrong with someone supporting the president. It's like supporting the home team and wearing a sports jersey, then someone who likes another team comes up and attacks you for it. That's called intolerance and this is exactly the type of buffoonery the liberals are practicing. Here's the video. I hope you took your blood pressure medicine because your veins are about to boil. He probably didn't realize he was being recorded. If he did, then he sure didn't care. However, that was a huge mistake he realized way too late, so went out for a 2 a.m. snack and my friend, wearing a MAGA hat, had his hat stolen and a drink thrown in his face, and mine, you can see my arms on the left of the video. That boy's quote should have been something like went out for a snack, food was good, came home and played some games instead, they were attacked by a triggered liberal who was too scared to confront a man his size. This guy went after a group of skateboarding video game teens who were just minding their own business. The man has been identified as Kino Jimenez and he's reportedly already been fired from his job. The teen who posted the video has already come out and said that they wish no violence against the man. Once again, the teenagers in this incident are more mature than the adult liberal who attacked them. The Kino Jimenez video is just another example of the unhinged behavior that helps make Donald Trump look like the best president we've ever had. In fact, he will probably be the best ever and that's just a fact you can fight no matter how many squishy liberal feelings you squeeze together. It was reported the man was arrested, so there's a thing you know as well. All these liberals acting out and filling their police record instead of growing their resume. Who really is the more responsible party here? That's the problem with these generic triggered liberals. Had this man stepped up to anyone remotely close to his size, or age, then he would have been dropped like all of Mike Tyson's opponents when he was battering people like Hike beating on Tina. This man would have faced instant karma had there been any adults in the room who saw this attack on teenagers take place. I'm no doctor, but I can tell a mental case from a mile away when I see someone bashing on teenagers for wearing a hat they don't like. People with a good head on their shoulders would just roll their eyes and move along if they saw something they don't like. Not today. The liberals, as weak as they are, are constantly belittling people and attacking them. They show up in droves like flocks of gnats and swarm people, but then get swatted really hard and constantly knocked out. Here's a liberal getting knocked out in one punch after he attacked someone with a baton. Liberals are always acting like they're the tolerant party who accepts everyone for who they are and loves everyone regardless of their beliefs. However, that's one big lie. The liberals are the people who are showing up to events uninvited, protesting, bringing violence to situations that don't require it. Here's what you need to know, if you're a liberal, then no one cares what you protest or do and Trump will win in 2020. Grow up and be part of the solution instead of crying for four to eight years. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.